Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Please sit down. I will begin my weekly press conference, which I am obligated to do and which is sponsored by mybookie.ag. Um, what a week. What a week. Um, Eli sat and the streak ended. McAdoo and Reese were fired and a new era will begin. The team is 2-10 and ten, and who, who knows how this shit fest of a season is going to end up. But I promise you this. We're going to give it 100% because we are pros. Uh, I gave you my thoughts about Eli Manning earlier in the week. I uh, would love to repeat that he has been a warrior for this team since 2004. Anyone who doesn't recognize how difficult it is to start that many games in a row for that many seasons in a row is a moron. Uh, it's hard for the locker room attendants to work every game since 2004, let alone a professional quarterback in the NFL. And uh, please, let's not forget the poundings Eli took in important playoff games that led to Super Bowl appearances and victories. Uh, give Eli a lot of credit. He's the ultimate soldier, and he deserves respect. He's got knocked down, and he always gets up. And for those of you who say, uh, oh, now you're kissing his ass in the past, you always uh, put him down. Well, I'm a straight shooter. For those of you who don't know, I speak my mind. I'm honest. I'm not politically correct. I give credit to my uh, players when they deserve the credit. And I uh, let them know when they suck. Okay? Okay. Uh, Reese spent many years in the organization, and we appreciate his effort but it was time for him to go. Uh, every dog has its day. Too many recent years with no playoff appearances and or losing records. I can't have that. We're not, we're not animale. Uh, McAdoo. It was time for him to go also. If you go from 11 wins one year to two wins the next, it doesn't take a genius to understand next year he would have won minus six games. I can't have that. We're not animale. Okay, let's talk football, shall we? This week, we have the Cowboys coming to town. America's team. Yeah, yeah, okay. America's team, my ass. Maybe, maybe South America's team. What the fuck makes these chooches from Yahooville America's team? Fuck them. And you can print that. Any team that has a cow and boys in their name should be playing in the CFL. And that's all I got to say about that. Unless I have more to say. They are totally beatable. Okay? Dak Prescott isn't what he was last year. All right? Zeke is out and Garrett looks like Opie from fucking Mayberry RFD. And that's that. There's nothing we could do. Okay. Uh, having said that, while my mother-in-law has not decided on uh, what she will bet this weekend, she will go to mybookie.ag, put in the promo code, capital VIC50. It's a different promo code for the press conferences only. It's VIC50 and bet something. I will have that information on Sunday for all you, for all you uh, people, okay? She is 19-7-1 so far this year. Okay, if you like to bet, go to my bookie. If you like to have sex, go to my, my nookie. If you like Aaron Judge, go to my rookie. And if you like ex New York Mets, go to my mookie. Otherwise, I couldn't give a fuck what you people do. Gabish? Good. Okay. I have the injury report. Here we go. Casillas, snapper breath possible. Shepard, infected taint, maybe yes, maybe no. Uh, Goodson, man goo in the eyes, questionable. Harrison, jerk off, elbow, doubtful. Munson, scrotal, concussion, in and out. Pew, strained colostomy bag, messy. There you have the injury report. Okay, then, you know, it's not too many injuries this week. Uh, we're actually pretty healthy going into this game. Uh, I have no idea who's starting at quarterback. That decision will come later in the week when the Maris wake up from their hangover and approve a decision. 
Spags is running the team as head coach and running the defense as usual. Uh, Sullivan will call the Pop Warner plays on offense, and everyone else will do whatever the fuck they do before, during, and after a game. All right? That's it. That's all I got. I got nothing more to say. There's food in the other room. You do your thing. We will do our thing. And we'll all be at the stadium Sunday to see what the fuck happens. I have a team to prepare for, so I will leave now. If you have any questions, please feel free to write them down and throw them in the garbage can over there in the corner. Good day. Go Big Blue. Watch it there. Put your foot in, you fucking moron.